first question for y'all is uh, how would y'all rate y'all's overall experience with math? Oh, it was uh, great. Let's go one to ten. One to ten? I'm going to say ten plus. Yeah, yeah, he was great. He, he was really great. was. What do you think made him stand out more than other agents? Well, one thing was he was always available to give advice. Mm -hmm. I mean, he was always there. He was really quick and responsive. He was great. If we had a question that he didn't know the answer, he found the answer, depending on what type of question was, but within hours I was asking the question. So y'all would say that he uh, communicated efficiently? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah above and beyond he got us in real fast to see each house we asked for did matt provide y'all with a lot of significant information to help y'all make that purchase oh yeah for yeah. sure were there any challenges that he helped y'all overcome throughout the transaction or anything like that i think the biggest thing was we have an fha loan mm -hmm. and so there's always a question of will this pass so there yeah. was a lot of that we dig through each of the houses and look for problems potential problems yeah and just going through the website and the app and everything trying to find houses okay well this one looks good it's in the price range let's go see this one get there and it's not going past fha because it's missing something or paint's peeling or something like that the fha guidelines are one of the hardest things to go through yeah and you think matt knew those very well and if he didn't know it he found out the answer real quick oh, yeah. <laughs> that's always great to hear Did matt help you negotiate prices any or, or was it more of just like a solid like the price they had and gave them the offer? oh he helped us he helped us he mainly left it up for us to make the, the proper decision and it's like, okay let's ask x amount of dollars you know it's like let's ask this one it's like okay that's a good starting point and we can start negotiating from there did you learn anything from matt throughout the transaction that you may not known before oh yeah we've learned all kinds of things do you mind sharing what one of those might be i think one thing he had mentioned one of the houses that we looked at didn't have a stove and it's kind of humorous but he had mentioned that fha required a stove but if it was a va loan it just had to have a hookup for a stove i thought that yeah. was entertaining yeah that's something i didn't know about yeah do you think there was any areas that matt may have could have improved in the transaction i uh, know it was great no problems it was great did matt help y'all navigate through the paperwork help it bring kind of down to a simple term yes. for for y'all to understand oh absolutely. yeah absolutely any document he brought to us it went through thoroughly to make sure we understood what we were going to sign what that document meant for us so y'all felt like y'all knew everything on that contract just as well as he did pretty much yeah. he even printed it out we signed it on digitally mm -hmm. and he printed it out and brought us the printed copy and that was great did uh matt meet all of y'all specific needs oh yeah. Oh, yeah. oh yeah so it says that matt helped negotiate with some minor plumbing repairs and, and stuff like that do you think that he did a good job with that and, oh yeah and oh, yeah helping find the right work and all that because y'all said y'all worked with the fha loan so it had to be fixed right right did yeah. he recommend the people to work with or did y'all find that on y'all's own um that was up to the seller to have those minor things fixed if you had to give matt a level of professionalism in real estate transactions what would you give him if it's one to ten a hundred mm -hmm. yeah he was great totally great absolutely i mean one of the best ones that we've worked with in a long time back in the day we kind of just kind of looked at houses and stuff mantle was not the only one we've worked with before but we've worked with mantle in the previous mm -hmm. just looking at houses not set to buy just looking at them we like the mantles company and everything so we went back with mantle when we were dead set on buying a house I got you. What do you most like about Mantle? What attracted you the most to us? You know, it was real easy. On the website, mm -hmm. you can just click to request a showing, and it was real fast. To, you know, you got back in like the next day. You didn't have to call and talk yeah. to somebody. You know, it's yeah, easier to just click a button. And the uh, the Mantle app, mm -hmm. looking at houses and stuff, was fairly easy to navigate through in our price range and looking at houses all over the place. Yeah, the app very is really convenient. Oh yeah, yeah really for sure. Convenient. Would you recommend Matt to one of your friends or family members if they needed to buy or sell? Oh, Absolutely. for sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Sure. What would you say to him if you did have to recommend? Him? Oh, wow. Well, uh, we, we know a really good realtor that goes over and beyond what is expected of a realtor. It would depend on the person, I guess. You know, it depends on who you're talking to, um, your relationship with and stuff. We definitely sing his praises. He took us everywhere we wanted to go, all different cities, everywhere. Yeah, it yeah. was great. At any time in the transaction, did you feel like that you were stressed out at all or, or anything with it? Or did you feel like it was just smooth sailing and you were cooking good? Smooth sailing as far as looking at through houses and stuff and once we found the one, it was smooth sailing all the way up to the, basically the end part where everything's mm -hmm. okay. Okay, here's the nitty gritty. We're getting down to it. That's when everything really starts to set in. It's like, okay, well, we gotta get the house back. Okay, we're getting ready to move. Okay, we're signing for this. Yeah. 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 That's where it all gets real chaotic. Yeah. 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 By nature. But, but, but other than that, he, he's always been just right there, communicative wise, and all, just right there for us. How many showings did y'all go on? If oh, you wow. remember? Probably a dozen. Ooh, we went on quite a few. Yeah, we went on quite a few. Yeah. yeah. 
try to get a, get a couple of houses in the same area mm -hmm. you know, to go look at between work and finding a house to go look at. You know, so it, and they're moving fast now. I'd say it was probably about a dozen. I say so. Do you think that you found your dream home, your forever home that you're gonna live in for a while, or maybe possibly the rest of your life? I think so. I think so. Yeah, I think so. Did y'all have any concerns about the real estate transaction before you even think about buying or selling? Do you have any concerns, stresses, in anything? I think by nature the whole process is kind of stressful. I mean, you're talking about oh yeah, you know, big life decision kind of thing. Yeah, well, for most people, you know, it is. It's the yeah. biggest life decision that they'll ever make. Oh yeah. Yeah. How do you think Matt's knowledge on the uh, local market is? Do you think he was very aware of the local market, or do you think? To the best of his ability, yes. Yeah, yeah, especially yeah. the local, local ones. I and mean, we drug him out to, like, Way one out. of those Meisenheimer, things like that, places yeah. you probably never had any need to go. But, yeah, yeah I mean. He did his research before, previous to that. That's pretty much it right there. Awesome. Do y'all have anything else y'all want to say? And Matt was great to work with. Oh, yeah, really great. Yeah. It was great.